selections. Like I'm talking about. Oh my God. Oh, he's going oh my for God. Oh! My New Orleans Saints offense and Miami Dolphins defensive ebooks are both on HotRouts.tips. So make sure you check them out with the link in the description. All right, in this first wave, there were four people. There was Civil, Throne, Prodigy, and JT. Right now, JT is like uh, Straven. He's a Minnesota Ofer, so he's going to be playing in that game. He's not going to be able to get out. He'll be taking on Prodigy, but who's already 2-0, and who's going to be getting in? We're going to have Civil and Throne in our what was supposed to be our B game is moving to the A screen and the winner gets in for all the marbles. This is what you want right here in a third game. Hey guys, welcome back to my next game from the DreamHack Anaheim Madden 20, $25,000 uh, Madden tournament. This game was out in, or this tournament was out in LA uh, a couple weekends ago. I showed you guys the first game that I played on stream. It was against Prodigy. Uh, the guy that ended up going on to win the entire tournament. Prodigy's been good in Madden for years, but uh, it's the first time he's made a really, really great run at a tournament. Uh, he's had that built in him for a while, and he ended up going on to win this this entire event. Um, but this is group stage right now, so I'm in a group with Prodigy, Civil, and the guy, this guy named JT, who I'm assuming was a local. Um, all three of us end up beating JT. I lost to Prodigy, Civil lost to Prodigy, and both those games were incredibly close. Actually, they were Prodigy's two closest games of the entire tournament, and there were... You know, many, I don't know, three other belt winners out there. There were so many other really, really good Madden players. You guys kind of saw a, a, a snippets of some of the groups. Many names you'll recognize. This is a strong tournament. It's probably the, the most top-heavy dream hack I've seen. And unfortunately, three of us got placed in the same group um, who, who had uh, chances to make deep runs. So today's game is against Civil. He's the Tampa Bay Bucks club champion. Uh, the winner advances to single elimination. The loser gets eliminated. And... Uh, Civil and I have played pretty much all year. We're friends. Uh, we actually slept in the same bed the night before this. The night before this game. Okay, we know each other that well, but no, no, we play each other a lot. Um, I played him the night before in the Airbnb. He was running uh, a cute scheme with with Lamar Jackson out of a slot in Carolina Panthers playbook, and uh, yeah, we we put it we put it in a snuggie, and he doesn't end up using the Ravens today because of it. So he runs a different scheme against me, a uh, more natural scheme with the Chiefs. And you're gonna see this. Uh, it's a, it's another really good game, but um, just keep that in mind. Civil and I have played each other so much this year. You know, tons of respect to Kenny, and um, I hope you guys do enjoy this. If you do want to see more tournament games or more uh, competitive games like this, make sure you hit the like button and let me know in the comment section below. And I hope you guys do enjoy this. Also, go drop a follow on Kenny's Twitter and his YouTube. They're gonna be linked down below. And also, if you saw the main my main channel. Kenny or Civil was the one who was on the voice with me for my last video at Inside the Mind. So Civil and I know each other really, really well. Really good Madden player. I have a ton of respect for him, uh, and hopefully you guys enjoy this game. Anyways, what you see you then. Against this offense, it's more about it's more of a chess match, and I like that. But back in the day, it was just about picking up the yeah, sticks yeah. and playing. Rocket it was catch, yeah. rocket catch, jetpacks. I you could just show up and yeah. It wasn't that easy. No, I mean you you could show up and. Kind of not freestyle, but you could definitely freestyle more than what you could now. Like some of the all-time freestylers like Mo were better back then because he could he could kind of adjust as the game was going on. Now, with especially the shorter quarters, you need to have a plan. You need to stick to it or you're going to get blown out. All right. Chiefs on Chiefs. I like Kansas City to win this one. Mahomes with the scramble. He can do it all, can he? Like, we never went into practice mode back in the day. No, oh, no. Hardly ever. It was always just play the game and figure it out that way. Now it's, you got to be yeah. in practice mode figuring out be everything. Like a scientist out here yeah. on these streets, you know? But now a big fourth and one. He didn't get the first down with Ooh. that scramble. Now big fourth and one. He Quick has hike. Nice. That's a dot. No, he oh. dropped it. Who's Winchester? Winchester. Why is he on the field? Who's Winchester? Changing teams. A guy that will never play again. Oh my wow, gosh. What a costly mistake by Civil. And that's what happens when you switch, switch teams, teams mid-tournament. Mid mid-tournament. You didn't know the personnel for his squad. He's got Winchester out there. Never heard of the guy in my life and drops a big fourth down. The only person that can switch teams like that is Kerry Q. Shout out to him. He'll be in the second wave. But it's hard to you get used to playing with one quarterback, one Shout offense. out to RG. RG? Oh, RG I the see goat. RG Madden there. Oh RG gosh. the GOAT in the chat. Yes, My and Boston I have to brother. agree. 04 KOTC in Houston. That's Chuggy Candyman. Trap jaw on them. That's past senior citizen. That's like the Golden Girls. Thank you for being a friend. <laughs> <laughs> they were old when I played. <laughs> so. Uh, <sighs> oh, yes. RG, you got to love him. The voice of Madden, the Madden of Madden. 
the man to men. I like that. Yeah, so now we got thrown with that big stop, and he's going to come out in this Green Bay Packers playbook. He's going to go to a lot of tight offset, try to go deep. He's got some doubles weak he throws in there, a little bunch. inside zone right there he had it looks like uh civil could blow it up at the middle but then he kind of stuttered and then thrown took it to the outside for a three yard gain i've noticed civil really likes playing coverage defense you know he doesn't really send the dogs much he's gonna have maybe get a little aggressive here against this type of offense although if he puts rushes three with a spy might control mahomes a little bit i don't think this three three five defense though is the move for this it's that, not slowing know. this down or nothing no. he is having his way he's going no huddle because if it's not broke don't fix it yeah, he's just going inside zone every play. And I would keep going to that until he can show he can stop it. Yep. For those of you looking for an update in the Prodigy JT game, Prodigy is up 14 to nothing already. He's looking strong. Yeah, Prodigy about to go 3 0, it looks like here. Civil just used his slot cornerback to spy uh, Mahomes. Something that I thought we'd see. Uh, if Prodigy you're do. Civil. You have to be still kicking yourself knowing that you're playing in a win and get in game or you could lose and not make it there when you had that game, the first one against Prodigy. Yeah, that's a game of inches, right? Game of single plays and all he had to do was slide and he accident. All he did was press X a little too hard. That's all he did a little too hard than he needed to. And that cost him a game. And he will be ever for like if he doesn't win this game, he'll be haunted by that forever. Yeah, that can hurt. Corner out back to the end zone. What a dot. What a dot by T Throne. He's looking at the crowd. He's a showman, those YouTubers. Yeah. And that's <laughs> that's what you like to see from him. Mixed it up a little bit, yep. took what the defense gave him. Wasn't just waiting for Tyreek to just run a track meet. <laughs> that's a good dot right there. Yeah, he yeah. went with that Y out swing play, you know, ever so popular in that tight offset. Corner out, back of the end zone, and the YouTube sensation, Young Throne with a hot dot to take the lead. Shout out to Drag. Drag he's, racer? He's a nice guy. He's nice. Oh, yep, he's on that He's list. having a kid coming here. Yeah, congratulations. He's never going to be good again. <laughs> yeah, once the kids, that's <laughs> when you know you're old. If you have a kid. Yeah. Oh. Shout out to Mr. and Mrs. Drag. The Bethany. best Madden player that's a father. Problem? Rest in peace, Bobby, please. Yes, sir. He was. He was a beast. He'd be talking to me at 3 a.m. while he'd be feeding his kid in the lab. Miss Definitely. him. Look at that. Nice that stick work by my home. Stick work, yeah. Nice stick work right there. Now Civil's in a tough spot. Got to get down the field here. User. User's the best one right now, currently. Yeah. 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 One great user. Yep. Shout out to Charlotte. I'll actually be seeing him Thursday. Real. Now, he's a good dude, too. Yeah, he's oh, a yeah. Good, real good dude. And you know what? Actually, I think I would use stand-up guy for him. Like, you know, like, you watch those Bob movies? Like, he's a real stand-up yeah, guy. He's a bit of a diva, though. No, no, He can no, be. No, no, yeah. He can be. He With the steaks be. when he get, orders the steaks at restaurants. No, nope, stop, 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 stop. Because oh, you're exactly like this. And here's what I'll tell you. There's a difference between being a diva and then wanting what you pay for. True. Wanting to get what you pay for. My thing is if Burger King can do it my way, why can't we just, we just, we just went out in San Francisco and he had he sent his steak back. Yeah, see? <laughs> and Rico thinks uh, that's normal behavior. Here's the goat, though. You, <laughs> did, did Vilma just throw out there users not better than him? First of all, I didn't know Vilma was a Oh, yeah, Vilma has a child. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But here's what I'll tell you. I love user over Vilma. Right and, now. And user was a club champion this year. Vilma, you and know. Multiple time club champion. No. Yes, well, he won the challenge. He oh, won City back yeah, in the day. Yeah, City's right. back and right. probably has the greatest trash talking line. See, this new generation likes to pat everybody on the back and say everything. He might have had the greatest interview trash talking line ever. After he beat a returning challenge winner, Ed Reed, he looked at the camera during his interview and said, I'm not, he said, I'm not saying that Ed Reed is garbage, but they do have some similarities. <laughs> yeah. and, and User has some great stories, man. Oh, this guy, hey, he, his when, stories are just the best. When we were in Dallas, he had me laughing so hard in, in, a, in an Uber. He was just gassing up our Uber driver, talking about he should quit his job and run his company and blah, blah, yeah, blah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he just had me rolling the whole time. Yeah. That's why I knew this guy was hilarious. Speaking of which, we have some Uber games for tonight. Oh. <laughs> I was oh. shocked. Who was in the car when we were playing those last time? You asked me what the who, uh, <laughs> members. I can't say that. Yeah, I was shocked that you didn't know that. 
Yeah. He asked me how many members of the Wu-Tang Clan did I know, and you I didn't know. name not one That's member Tyler. of the Wu-Tang. He won't know. Yeah, I don't know if I know the See? names either. <laughs> you live in Boston. You're telling me you don't know not one name of a Wu-Tang Clan member? No, nah, I don't think I do. Don't even start with that stuff, Rico, because you're scared of it, my dog that weighs six pounds. Shout out to Rainy. Shout out to Rainy. Shout out to Rainy. She's, she's on the beach right Evan now. Evan Rainy? Doing life. No, not Cujo. Rainy. No, no. It's, not, it's Rainy. New Rico. I mean, <laughs> that's not Evan Rainy. <laughs> Oh, no. Evan Rayner. My, Evan my Rainer. dog, yeah. Rainey. Oh, I thought they called him Rainey. Evan Rayner. Great guy. Great guy. Speaking of great guy, trailing 7 nothing, he is still here focused, <laughs> locked in, trying to make this happen. Is this civil on offense? What's he running? Ooh, a little Into the end is zone. he out of he doing it? He's in the, because he's coming out from a slot oh, going down. Oh, like a nerd. That's glitchy. I like that. That's a good stretch, kind of. It's against certain things. Yeah, it's not bad. Oh, okay. Also, by the way, I might like <laughs> Velma over one great user right now, too, by the way. Yeah. I think I'll 100%. bet on Velma. Now I... that user can't get people pancake. We hey, 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 do not support hey, Campbell. If I was a betting hey, man. <laughs> user, he can't pancake everybody on, his def on the defense anymore with those abilities. They got yeah. patched. I think it'd be a good game matchup, though, honestly. No, I, I think I like Velma, too. You like him to flood? I don't like him to flood. No. I, Velma's kind of like soft. You know, he... <laughs> Shot the Velma, that's my guy. I'm not gonna let y'all. Uh, I gotta put no. more respect on user's name. What? Besides Connecticut and, and splitting those <laughs> casino, <laughs> the six man casino tournaments with is. Jay Bird and T. Davis. Hey. That's the only reason why T. Davis said Velma, is because they, yeah, they meet up in the casino and <laughs> split hey, lunch money five, every five people. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna fly in for one of those. I'm sick of that. No, it's, it's and all they're playing are the kids whose parents are gambling. Yeah. <laughs> here, here, buddy, go play in this mad tournament. Yeah. It's fifty dollars. Oh man. Say it's, hi to Aquaman for us. Oh, and there you have it, another great score, and we are tied up seven seven. You got to be back in it, or you, you're still reeling from that first stop. Yeah, Civil with the big driver there, and he needed that after that stop on his first drive. He comes back, ties the game 7-7. He was, he was very balanced on that drive, too. Ran the ball, passed the ball. So now we got a ball game, boys. It's winning, get in, and we got a tie matchup. Love to see it. Oh, and there goes that spin, and that almost was trouble. Now, after giving up that touchdown, you know Throne's going to want to try to figure out a way to get in the end zone, and hopefully he does not fall back into that one-hitter quitter since he has all this field to cover. Yeah, exactly. He's got to go from underneath stuff. I like the way this inside zone is working, except right there, but like you said, Rico, he's really got to, you know, take these underneath routes, go with the dink and dunk, work your way down the field, and get and secure yourself a spot in that single elimination playoffs. Oh, man, I love 3-D5. Wish it was better this year. It's underrated, though. I think it's still pretty it's good. Right. Like, when I play it, I have some trouble. Compared to last year, though? Good. Yeah, oh. obviously, last year was insane. That was probably the best year it's ever been. Oh, for sure. It used to be good in, like, the old NCAA yeah. games, too. I don't know if you remember. It was good one year in Madden, like, Madden 12, I think it was, Madden 13. Mm. Peyton Hillis one. Yep. Peyton Hillis, wow. How did he get on a Madden cover? There's a vote. I know, but... Yeah. It's crazy. All right, now. Shout out to Self Made Rock in the chat. The eye tight originator. Solid guy. Who he is. Can't believe you said you like the Bill Bowler. You're biased, Rico. What a dot. Feed in? Oh. Ooh, tough break right there. And now it's a fourth and eight. What do you think Throne's going to do here? I'm going to look for him to throw the ball to Tariq Hill 70 yards down the field. <laughs> <laughs> you, might, you might think I'd about punt punting this. here, though. Yeah, I'd Madden 20. For sure. You're the punter. Civil's just sitting back in that 3 3 5. Not the Ray guy. This is 100% going to be a Hall of Fame. Ray guy? Yeah, he went in a couple years ago. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Like, I'm Shout out to Jack. Of course you know. He's, that. Another, he's a stand up guy, too. I love yeah, Jack. Jack, good guy. Jack of LA. Speaking of which, I got to get back to Minnesota. That juicy Lucy's calling me. That That's, burger with it's the not cheese. that great. I, I stop hating. <laughs> you don't also don't like the sweet Martha cookies? No, I like homemade cookies. A day, a day later. That sugar cookie that they oh, have. Oh yeah, that sugar cookie. The caterer in here's been excellent. I'm about to get real big. 
Are you shocked that we saw a punter come out? Yeah, he, he looks like he thought about his decision for a couple minutes there and decided to call a timeout. He was going to go for it now, and then he decides to punt it away. I've never seen If a... you're going to punt, why not just take the... Can I tell a Jag story? Yeah, but hold on. Why not right. take the delay game? Can you focus over here, Yeah, sorry. I'm done. Can All we right. focus over here on some right. John Madden? Now, RG, <laughs> here's where I'll tell you. I, I haven't been to the catering in Redwood City lately, <laughs> <laughs> but I have to give the edge here. Yes. It's out. They, they have phenomenal selections like i'm talking about oh my god oh, he's going oh my for god. Oh, god. Oh. did i tell you did i tell you did i tell you he said what was he gonna do no it's civil that was civil i just realized he's gonna <laughs> anything you can we, do i can oh my do we need a replay someone get a replay. a replay someone Please. put that on twitch that was one of the best dots you will ever see insanity here at dreamhack wow at 14 to 7 the momentum oh has shifted don't call it a that comeback disgusting what song is he singing right now? What's that Luke Bryan song? She's gone. Shake it for me, girl. No, but come on. That little T Pain might just make it rain. My kind of night. Yes. I don't know country dun, music. Dun, you don't dun. know Shake It for Me. I don't know Shania Twain. Yeah. That's it. Country girl, shake it for no. me. No. Oh, yeah, a little bit. I don't know, I guess. See, I, you know, I'm on the NASCAR circuit, so yeah. I, I have an entire. I only know a few. But. That Luke Bryan song. That's that my kind of night. That was such a dot. That was let's, see if he, let's see if he <laughs> cooks one up here to Tyreek. This by, is my type of John Madden By the football. way, update on the Prodigy JT game. Oh, my gosh. Prodigy's up 28 nothing. Did J, JT did score. He scored last game. So at least you know he can get something to build on. Next dream hack, we'll see him in Atlanta. In May? Dallas, or is it Dallas, Dallas in May? in May. Dallas in May, Atlanta in November. What's the catering menu as Tech Mobile? What's on the dock for tonight? Oh, taco actually, bar? hold on. Yeah, I think it's going to be a taco bar. No, is that like tomorrow? They, 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 sent the, they send you a menu, RG. Yeah, it's the like whole, you can pr pr prep your own. Wait, uh oh. Tech Mobile's back. Is that Snoop with him too? No, it's JC. Is it Snoop Compound? Uh, yeah. That's JC. Oh, okay. And you got to love how, look at, look at Strafing just dropping all these names. <laughs> GGL, let's go, baby. <laughs> he has his honorary uh, <laughs> gangster. Hey, these dudes, these dudes are mutt freaks. They, they got the best teams. They know everything about every card. I'm asking about, like, Raheem Mostert, if he's good. These guys know it all. And it's funny because they just started getting into mutt, like, okay. last year. So here's the question. We are out here on the West Coast. I am putting this out there to every and anybody from the GGL who can hear that. Strafen now has another teammate that can go and play. Two on two, Snoop, go get whoever you'd like. I'm still going with Strafen and Aquaman. Y'all about to get flooded. <laughs> well, that's what's happening. We're bringing Aquaman out there. Let's do we it, We had baby. a phenomenal time out there. I'm I I wasn't even supposed to be on the sticks that day. <laughs> I know but, you were. <laughs> but you stepped in. But I stepped in and I knew what nervous. I had to do. You were nervous. Tecmo says squads tournament soon. Oh, that's a terrible read. Up to the house. Sybil. Sybil's playing some good defense right now. He's using a spy, kind of messing with Mahomes. He can't wind up on those throws as well. Yeah, good he's defense. looked great. He's looked phenomenal on defense in this game. That 3-3-5 really given, throwing some trouble. Thrown, going to some formations he doesn't love. He went to that trips tight end and makes a bad read right there, and Civil's in complete control. I tell you what, that squads, though, is a different world. That is hard. Have you played squads, T. Davis? Uh, no, I have not played a lot of squads, honestly. I think that could be, you know, a future in Madden, though. I definitely want to get into it. JC. <laughs> Ooh, what is that? Roughing? Oh, legal forward pass. Now, you can't even make up that joke. It's new compound seven, and we don't want that smoke. <laughs> <laughs> we was, only lost 16 to nothing. I was recovering for two I weeks. I can't believe you couldn't go. You he scored, couldn't score, he couldn't score one, 17. He points. couldn't score three. I couldn't open my eyes. Because <laughs> the heat was coming that bad. They were blitzing from both sides. It was tough. But speaking of having oh, all the time in the wait, world, oh my God. he did it. He's again. open. Again. Done again. again. Wow. Civil is oh cooking gosh, over here, man. Dot. Wow. These dots are. He's running 30 yards backwards. That was beautiful. Crazy. 
So if we, in Madden Ultimate Team, if we put Roaming Deadeye, is that the one? If yeah, we put that on gets, our quarterback. He gets crossbody. Pro tip, he does that stuff. Yeah. He'll do that for you on, at home, yep. on your mud team. Roaming Deadeye. Roaming Deadeye, 65 cap. I think I gotta make room for that on my last yeah, chance. You're the guru around here. No, I'm not. I don't know. I'm the either. regs guy. You're the Speaking of guy. which, that last chance qualifier tournament is gonna be amazing. Oh, it's a dog fight. Yeah, it's it's insane. A, the oh, every game is a hell game on the yeah. leaderboards right now. It's scary. The finals. How many make it to the finals? The last four. <laughs> Did you see what Snoop got? I just said, man, was playing with the screen upside down. <laughs> Shout out to Rico. Rico did not even know how to adjust his camera in squads. And I'm supposed to rely on him to get a stop. I did. <laughs> I couldn't rely on you to get a score. Because <laughs> you were running routes <laughs> directly into the sideline. I don't want to talk about it. Moving on. Mahomes is lit up again. Uh oh. Dot! Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Yes, I was like, it was a That's laser. That's a nice touch, RG. I like that. <laughs> yes. Shout out. You know you always give the, the developers yeah. grief for everything in the game. That was a phenomenal sound effect. Perfect time. <laughs> that makes you want to go throw the pigskin in the back right here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Sybil, after that first drive, Sybil's come out, looked dominant here, 21 to 7, incomplete control, and he might be going on to the playoffs. How many people make the live event for the LCQ? Four? Eight. Eight? Four, four, each, four on each, four each system. Council. Yeah, four each system. Somebody make me a plus one. I want to come see the end of that. It's going to be a good tournament. You think you'll make it there? I'm trying. How about you, T. Davis? It's tough. I don't know. He's commentating. Must be nice. Oh, you commentating the LCQ? Possibly. Oh, I'm not. Me either. <laughs> All right, time out. Trying to make some most hey, of this. Let's let's take one more shot Sibyl's at it. He's been throwing dots with Mahomes. We made fun of him for switching, but this is the right call because he's comfortable throwing the football. Now he got he's got a team that can throw the football. Yep. We. You, you got to do what's strengths. comfortable. You got to do it. Was yeah. What are your strengths exactly? Good decision. So shout out to him for making that adjustment. Five seconds. Can he can he make something happen? Less than five seconds? I'm if you're if you're civil, you gotta be in the quarter three deep. I this wouldn't mess around here. This game's really gone south for uh yeah, that throwing is. the way after it started. Didn't he get a stop he right away? He, got, he went up seven nothing. Stop and score? Yeah, stop and score, and it just civil like I said, civil's been looked phenomenal since then. Ooh. And there you have it, defense. the end of the first half. So there we have it, 21 to seven, civil, overthrown. Not what we thought was gonna happen early, but hey, it's been back and forth. I think uh, Throne is gonna try to one or two, three play, drive here, get a quick score, get himself back in it. But the good news is civil doesn't really run the ball, run the clock that much. He wants to dot, dot, dot. So. He can't milk the way he probably wants yeah, to. Yeah, but the what bad news What was the word is... you just said? Oh, no, I knew I shouldn't have said it. <laughs> There's no E in the word milk. <laughs> <laughs> he really said M-E-L-K, it's, it's, milk. It's my Wisconsin accent. Don't even. <laughs> yeah, but see, the bad news here for Throne is like, if you're going to do that, you, this could turn ugly. Because you need you need to uh -oh. slowly get the ball. He's, so going, he's going for, for glory every play. Just, yeah, I know. It, could got... turn, it can either score quickly or it can turn ugly and get blown up. Well, I so. mean, it worked from the first game, kind of. Well, second game. No, actually, yeah. didn't. He didn't win. But that's kind of what he's locked into right now. And yeah, it's hard it was... to matriculate the ball throwing every play. Yeah, you want exactly. those big chunks. And and we saw Prodigy easily go 3-0. You know, he, he beat JT by 30. So Prodigy goes 3-0 in this first game. All right, gets to the outside. Right, gets it out to there. Ooh, great. Look. Now he's already cooking here. Second play of the drive is at the 39. You can move down the field, but you still got to get points. Uh oh, Mahomes is lit seven. up again. He's going to throw this thing 70 yards. Well, that's going to be out of the end zone. You're right. Math is hard. Not for me. <laughs> Not for, for you either. T. Davis, it is. <laughs> Apparently. Oh, he set the dog. Corner out he's again. got him. Oh, jeez. Oh, would you throw in that corner route? Yeah. It's Mahomes. You can throw them all. Somebody's asking for snow and penalties and salary cap. No, don't do that. Snow? Snow. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, Mahomes is lit up. I want to see some. I want to hey, see something shake. Yo, something shake. Listen magic. What I say, right next yo. to Disneyland. I want to see some magic, baby. I got your hey, yo. In route. Listen. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. He baited him back to the There's dig. There's that dead eye. Back to the dig. On and the run. Went to the, that's just good John Madden football right there. 
All right, 21 to 7. Civil in control of this. The winner gets in. Loser gets to watch some great men. Could you imagine being RG and people are asking you to put snow in the game? <laughs> the things he gets asked on a daily basis? It comes from you guys, so it doesn't really matter. Like, Somebody asked a great question, and let me answer them. They said, why are the players playing in the dark? Dot! Nice dot right there. Nice Touchdown. Dot. He, ducked it. he ducked it for a little bit, brought the icons back that, up, threw a nice dot. That's a big drive right there for throwing to get back in the game, 21-14. And he got it methodically by moving down the field. Exactly. He didn't try to do too much at one time. He was the definition of doing too much. Yeah, exactly. That's what we said about him. He's just You, you don't want to keep going for glory every play. You want to move the ball slowly, and he did just that to get himself back in the game. Doogie, Doogie man in the chat said, I'd be strafing. Get back to the MCS, please. I've been trying all year, buddy. <laughs> just hasn't yeah. been working out for me. It's been a rough year it's for both of us. Year. Both of us. It's been the roughest year ever yeah. for me. Me too. You too, Rico. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a tough one for all of us up here. It's been a... Hey. <laughs> the struggle makes us better. The struggle <laughs> makes us better. All right, now he's looking to get a defensive stop here. He's going to need something. And as you guys said, Civil's going to give him every chance by flicking that rock all over the field to get a stop. Wide open wheel rope. Try to hit him with the stop and it go. It always makes me nervous the way LaShawn McCoy carries the ball. Yeah, he does the Deion yeah. Sanders thing too. High step one, in prime one time. Hand. Yeah, one hand. Is he the best corner ever, Rico? Deion Sanders? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, hard to what argue about, that. What about Charles? Woodson? Yeah. He's more... Top five guaranteed. I'd have to really look. Oh, I was saying top one. No, no, no. Just because... Just because he can do everything. Is that Shady? He's going to go all the way. Let's go. Wow. Pick up the knees. What well, a Sean run. McCoy showing the speed burst. Oh, one trap for 80 yards, 60 <laughs> yards. <laughs> this guy's a freak. He And you know what? He's showing the diversity in his playbook. He's opening it up. He's running everything. Keeps you all balance. What a play call. Yeah, oh, one trap for 60 yards. Wow. And the thing that crazy, uh, LaShawn McCoy got to the end zone off that. Electrified game is trying to bring you guys down. He ain't mad for play. play. He ain't play mad for sure. Sounds interesting to me. As long as Rico Williams is there, I'm there. Oh, thank you. Even though Electrified Gaming didn't even invite me. How do you block somebody on this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, my home is lit up. Call the cops. What is this? The Trey Y flex action. Oh, okay. All right, he's got to the outside trying to. Ooh, he oh, he gets it off. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh! Honey, oh! what a pick. Yeah, that's not the best read. That's thrown. Just, he's, he's, yeah, he doesn't know what to do right now. He's just trying to get something going and just a bad read. That's tough. He said, Rico, you my guy. We're good. We're in. Get the trio out there. I need to get my acid reflux medicine. I drink too much coffee. I'm dying over here. You want to know how I know I'm old? Acid I drink, reflux. I drink coffee. Yeah, acid reflux. I don't drink coffee. You don't drink coffee? No. What? Hot chocolate. That doesn't give you energy. <laughs> I don't need energy. What are you, 12? I really no. drink hot chocolate. Rico don't need energy. You know who Rico is. It's true. He's energized He's a ball seven. of energy. Can't stop. Won't stop. <laughs> You really don't drink coffee, though. No, not at all. If I don't drink coffee in the morning, I, like, lose my mind. I'm addicted. But, I don't really either. I've been getting into but it, But you could convince me to have a nitro cold brew if you wanted me to. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if I was going to drink coffee, hey, that's what it would be. When I was drinking nitro cold <laughs> brew in, in Dallas, I was literally up for, like, four straight days. I slept, like, three hours a night. That stuff is kind of potent. Yeah. <laughs> that's great stuff. Yeah. All right, 28-14. Looks like Civil has this one in control. Is do you start slowing it down and running clock? Yeah, but down? I would. He's throwing on first and ten. He's like, throwing a Winchester, to Winchester still. <laughs> what is going he's on? Throwing, he's throwing a drag to Winchester. I feel like that guy's name is James, but I do not know. Don't he you feel like he's James Winchester? Is that an old like? Uh, no, I feel like that's his name. Says somebody in a history book or something. That's no. what it sounds like. Shout out to Shock. Shock, we are in California now. Shock, OG Madden player. Him and Morris Chestnut, the actor, used to travel all around. And I'm talking about they were on the circuit traveling around for these $3,000 tournaments and things like that. Wow. 
traveling from California out there. It was all about the competition. Yep. Yes, sir. And beating everybody and everything yep. like that. Definitely. I used, to to, I, used to to, I used to travel to Ohio yeah. for like two thousand. Yeah, I used to. So it's all about the love of the game. I used to go on a plane to Texas for like a fifteen hundred. Yeah, exactly. It's all the... You pay a thousand to get there, and you're trying yeah, to get five hundred exactly. dollars. And uh, yeah. it's just stupid. It's crazy it's how like... everything's evolved too. Yeah, you know, I was now... thinking, God, if I win that, now we're here at Dream... <laughs> now we're here at DreamHack in Anaheim playing for twenty five thousand. I know it's, it's crazy. insane how we've evolved, and we love to see that in the community. We never thought NFL Network, ESPN, the draft. Pro Bowl, it's crazy. going to the Super Bowl, yep. to see where Madden's gone from there, it, it, it's absolutely phenomenal. I you guys to... have helped grow the game. Shout out to EA. Shout out to all these tournament promoters. Yeah, it's been great. The outlets. They've done nothing but put the game on a pedestal. Third and 11 here. And if you're civil, you just want to use this clock. Last play of the third quarter. All right, he's gotten to the outside. We're going to make something happen. Ooh. Oh, I'll never forget when they announced the club series and the MCS. I was in grad school, and I just I remember thinking our lives, a lot of our lives are about to change. Yeah. And that's really what happened. And look at you. I never even, I was in, never even on a plane before Madden. Like, I never had that much money growing up. My parents didn't travel. Next thing you know, I'm flying down to play on Jerry Jones' Jumbotron. And what's like, your, just because of Madden. And your MCS career earnings is over 100K, if I'm correct. Yeah. So, I mean, so it, this stuff can change your life. An instant like that, it just shows, you know, how great, how blessed we are, too, to be able to do what we love at a high level like this. We're lucky. Sure. Oh, he's got Tyreek. Why? This guy's just airing it oh, out. He doesn't nice. care. It's a dot. Hey, Aquaman. We might need you. He needs the floaties. <laughs> I gotta jump in there. I gotta might have to jump in there and save him. Shout out to mine too. I hope you're feeling better, dog. I, I'll be in Chicago one of these days soon. We gotta get back to Harold. Again, shout out to you. you got some surgery. He's doing better. Good. Good, Good stuff. Here, yeah. Chicago. Yep. Speaking of games in DreamHack, I was doing the Pokemon Go Fest. And Ooh. he came out and took me to oh, wow. lunch in between. You got to catch them all. <laughs> oh, it is James Winchester. He's a 41 overall. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Thank you, Maxwell. Coming in clutch. 41 overall tight end. James Winchester. Aquaman, get Frank the Pirate on Twitch. I think he means Doug the Pirate. <laughs> yes. I've talked uh, to my good that, friend hey, Straven here. That day's coming. I'm going to get back out coming there. Coming soon. Coming soon. We might, have to, we might have to do like a little yeah, do a little type class. of collaboration. As soon as, as soon as you finish that sponsorship deal, you know, you'll be right back on there. You're just waiting to find yeah, we'll see, yeah. the right one. Just waiting for the waiting for the perfect time. Yeah. Shout out to the people that used to watch those streams back in Madden 17. <laughs> Summertime. Missed those days. Oh, Ooh, he's got X. Did he have him deep? No, nope. there's a safety there. 35-14. Do you still think you have a shot here with four minutes to go? No. <laughs> so you know you've lost. Yes. Yeah, this is tough. I mean, you're going to have to score. It gets scary when you're down 10. There's much time left. Yeah. Although you got... This guy's just throwing around, throwing... Yeah, he's got some dots. dots. I'm not going to lie. His, his offense is fun to watch. This. You know, people want to show up and watch throw and play offense. You're going to get your money's worth, but it just won't be enough to get out of this group. No. Probably not. Oh, that's a pick. Oh. Top five. Corners. I was just Dion, Rod Woodson, Charles. Stop no that. particular order. No, no, no particular oh, order. Okay. Dion, Except Rod Woodson, Rod. Charles Woodson, yeah. Daryl Green. No. Champ? Oh, yeah, you got to go Champ. Yeah. Ooh, you know what? Champ's ahead of him. Revis. And then Revis. Yeah, I like yep. that. Okay, yep. what about the Revis Sherman argument? Because I got, I got takes there. I, I got hot am takes. team Sherman. On what? That. Let me explain to you why. Stop it. Let me explain to you why. You're a Jets fan. All right, explain it. Just because you're asked to do something in a team structure doesn't mean, just because you're not asked to do something in team structure doesn't mean you can't do it. He is playing his position. He's listening to his coach. He's following what he says. They don't want him to travel. He's not going to travel. That's why he had the rest of the Legion of Boom. They had everybody else. Yeah. Like, let's say, let's switch it to basketball. If LeBron could shoot more threes if he wanted to, but that's not what the offense needs from yeah. him. So he doesn't. It doesn't mean he can't do it. It just means that's not what he's asked to. So you can't take that away from somebody for excelling in their game plan that their coach put together. I agree with Rico 100%. I mean, he just, there's no Are need you, for him but, to. But Revis was the scheme. 
That, but that's just what the Jets didn't have. Like, no, even Cromarty. I'm like, saying you, the number one thing I want my cornerback to do is to cover. Okay, but they're saying he didn't get on him because he didn't travel with the best receiver. He wasn't asked to travel. Their I know. The scheme wasn't that. But you also have to look at, like, you, your point is that they had a team and a scheme, like cover three, sit in cover three, rush the passer, stay on your side, cover your third. Revis wasn't allowed the luxury of doing that because he wasn't surrounded by two great pass rushers, a Hall of Fame safety, maybe okay. another Hall of Fame safety. And look, and look uh, two great coverage linebackers. Like, it's, you have to, the situation plays a factor in the evaluation. Yeah, and it goes both ways is what I'm saying. I'm not saying that one is better than the other. All I'm saying is you're, they both were amazing in what their coach asked them to do. I'm going to have to be I'm the just... mediator here because you guys could go on for hours with this debate. <laughs> so. All right, we'll just table it for another I do another agree with Rico, but, I'm, you know. But need... Revis was – in the in the day and age where you couldn't be, hardly touch a wide receiver, Revis was basically running backwards, shutting down the best athletes in the world. Yeah, but this has also helped Sherman's longevity too. Revis was out of the league way, That's true. way quicker than Sherman. But was. he also was in a bad situation. He went to Tampa and they made him in like a Tampa two corner. Yeah. I don't know. That's an interesting <laughs> argument. We're both good. All right, then. Oh. <laughs> and another sack. 35-14. This guy. Our first wave is about to come to an end. If you're Prodigy, you're 3-0. and You got out of this. Might have not played your best, Madden, but you played good enough to get here, and you're making it to play again tomorrow. If to you're over. Civil... Do you feel even better coming out of this after the adversity you faced in that first game? Yeah, I think you feel good. I mean, you got un it was unfortunate in that first game how it ended up, but I think you're confident because you you feel like you really went 3-0 and almost. I mean, you, you played great in these last two games. That first game, you got a little unlucky. So if you're still, you got to come out here thinking, oh, I, I should have went 3-0. and I feel good. I think his confidence will be high going into tomorrow. Yeah, and that'll do it right there. 35-14. Yeah, so obviously this game ended up getting a little bit out of control. We uh we started it off really well, and unfortunately, I... Yeah, it sounds so bad for me to sit here and justify what I'm doing. Civil had a deep half glitch to where he was able to bomb cover two. I I knew you could bomb cover three with the play post, um, with that deep post, especially with Tyreek and Patrick Mahomes. I knew you could, so I was leaving my deep half out there, and I didn't know if there was a, a glitch for the deep half also. So I end up giving it to him for free twice in this game. And because of it, I end up trying to go to Big Dime and I get 0-1 trapped. And I, I knew I would get 0-1 trapped if I was in, mid, in Big Dime. If I don't get bombed, I feel like this is a different game. But um, yeah, I get, I get bombed twice. You know, just really, really good play by him. Uh, you know, Kenny's Kenny's a dog. I, he, that's my dude. Civil's, Civil's my guy. And uh, as you can see, you know, one of my friends, you know, he, he felt terrible for me after this. Like, we did not want to be in the same group with each other because we both wanted to advance the next day. And unfortunately, we're in a position where only one of us could but uh anyways hopefully, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video uh i know i'm gonna get clowned in the comments a lot for this one um i got i got certainly flooded after after the you know the flood the floodgates opened and um there's really no stopping them the wheels fell off the bus on this one so anyways i appreciate you guys watching the video hopefully you did enjoy and uh if you want to see more competitive madden games make sure you leave a like and let me know in the comments anyways see you in tomorrow's upload what are your thoughts so far guys i mean it's everything we expected you know three of the top 16 players and Civil, you know, he did go into a one, but I think he's going to feel confident because that first game, he got a little unlucky. He feels like he really did go 3-0. So I think, I'm excited to see what Prodigy and Civil will do moving forward. I think Prodigy, I'm going to stick by my pick of being one of the uh, favorites to win this tournament. I think he escaped that throne game where he was giving up one-point touchdowns left and right. And uh, I think that's going to help him build confidence moving into day two. But I'm excited to see what the second wave will bring for uh, matchups and games. All right, the second wave, if it's anything like the first, it's going to be must-see action.